This is MMA Madness, Ryan McKinnell sitting down with Kendall Grove. How you doing today, Kendall? Good, good. Uh, can't wait to make weight and go eat some food and get, get, get to fighting, put on, put on a show. How you feeling? Feel good, feel great. I had a good camp this time around. Uh, I'm training now with Extreme Couture's here in Vegas. And who, who can I mention who's training there right now? You know what I mean? I'm training with the heavyweight champ every day. I'm training with Forrest Griffin, Mike Powell. This can go on and on, and uh, I, I, my head's right, and cardio's up there, and uh, I just can't wait. I'm excited. We just I just talked to Sean and uh, Randy, and I mean the camp there is just insane. Um, yeah, talk about it. Just talk about how cool it is to train with uh, all those it's legends. Cool. Uh, it's cool to go in there, get accepted. You know what I'm saying? I, I've been training there from December when there was just a cage in that thing, cage and concrete and a heater. I mean, and I, I watched that gym evolve, and um, who, like, I'm just blessed to be accepted in a gym like that. And all these guys, fuck, who, who would have thought? Like, Randy Couture would be talking to me like, I, I'm, like, we're family, you know what I mean? And that's one bond that I, I like about the gym is we're all family. We all got each other's back. Even though I'm, I, I get done training on, uh, I, I, I fight Saturday. Right. I'm back in the gym on Tuesday. Because I got my, my boy John Alessio is fighting the following Wednesday, WC. I got Tyson Forrest fighting in the, up in the next UFC. So, you know what I'm saying? The, uh, that's how we are. They, after they got done fighting, they came in and they started helping me for my fight. And I, I just took that to heart, you know what I'm saying? So I'm just stoked to be at a good, positive atmosphere at gym. Well, you were talking about family. Are you missing Hawaii at all? Um, I miss Hawaii every day, you know what I'm saying? Hawaii is Hawaii. Yeah. You, can't miss, you cannot miss that place. Um, and uh, But I'm up here for a reason, and that's to get my skills uh, up to par, be a world champ, and go home and open my own school one day. Yeah, is that something you like to do, is uh, train the future generation? That's my... You, that, that's what I want to do in the future because I work, I work construction and I ain't going back. <laughs> so that's, <laughs> might as well do something I love to do and that's teach. Yeah, summers in Hawaii on construction don't really, uh, mm. The working by the beach, yeah. lunch break, jumping in the ocean. Yeah. I've never done that, but. <laughs> yeah, never. That, it, <laughs> that's one thing, uh, that's the only thing I, I, I miss about Hawaii is the beach, the weather, and well, I can sit here all day and tell you what I miss about Hawaii, but I'm up here for a reason and that's to get better. It makes champions, right? That's, that's what makes champions. So what do you feel, uh, how are you feeling about Patrick? I heard you talking in there. Uh, you guys are, I mean, you looking uh, forward to the fight? Yeah, I, I respect the guy a lot. And it seems like in his interviews, he hasn't, like, he doesn't respect me. I doubt that. I'm pretty sure he respects me. Uh, but it takes a bigger man to admit it, you know what I'm saying? And I respect the guy. I respect everybody who steps into that cage, regardless. Yeah. And um, just some of the stuff that they told me he said kind of, so um, I'm not going to let that bother me. I'm just going to go in there. I train hard and like everybody else has put on a good show. And that's what I'm all about. I don't care if I win. I don't care if I lose. I said that a thousand times. I just want to go in there and fight. I love to fight. I grew up fighting. That's, this is my enjoyment. When I die, I picture heaven walking into a cage. That's, that's my heaven. You got, any, you got any good war stories from the uh, island of Hawaii growing up? You got any... <sighs> You know those? Uh, well, <laughs> well, I have a lot, but um, I like to uh, keep it on the wrap. That, that, that was the old Kendall. The old Kendall. Yeah. This is a new Kendall. Doing it for a living. Yeah, doing it for a living and getting paid for it. 